to assign the material properties, uh, scroll up and under geometry, select the part that we are analyzing. And once that's highlighted, if you look at uh, this details window here, you see that the material that's assigned is structural steel. So click on structural steel and you see, you know, the material that we added to the library shows up here. So select aluminum 6061 and double check that that's a material assigned to the part. So which means that ANSYS will use the Young's Modulus and Poisson Ratio for the aluminum 6061 in Hooke's Law and G is derived from those two parameters. So it's going to use the form of Hooke's Law with the constants that we need.